American Dream Machines opened our doors in 2003. We've sold thousands of cars all over the country and all over the world. And we've learned the hard way. We had to fix them. We bought a lot of classic cars here and had to fix a lot of problems. Classic cars can be your biggest money pit or your best investment. The three-year bumper-to-bumper warranty with roadside assistance went out the window a long time ago with these cars. These cars do have older parts and they are going to break down. It's just part of owning an older car, and that's the reality. Whether you buy a car from an auction, another dealer, or American Dream Machines, there's a great deal of questions you should be asking before you buy the car. People always ask me, are your cars as good as they look on the internet? Yes and no. These 1967 Corvettes are some of the best I've ever seen. They're amazing, but not perfect. Every 50-year-old car is going to have 50-year-old parts, and that's what makes them valuable in the first place. We have some amazing cars here at American Dream Machines. If you're a perfectionist, though, it's very important that you come and inspect the car in person. There are imperfections with every 40, 50, 60-year-old car. There may be imperfections in chrome, there could be paint imperfections, glass may have marks on it, it may not be brand new glass like today, this is brand new which is nice. You may have wear in the seats, wear on the dash, there could be imperfections with every one of these cars. Old cars are awesome, I love old cars. But old cars are going to drive like an old car. The suspension is older technology. The body lines might not fit quite as good as a new car. The rubber and trim is not going to be quite as airtight going down the road. People ask if our cars are restored. Some of our cars are restored to an extensive level. Some of them are more driver quality. When you're asking about restoration, there could be frame off restoration, there could be cosmetic restoration, rotisserie restoration, ground up restoration. Make sure and be specific in regards to the type of restoration to make sure that you get what you expect. People ask, are your cars rust free? We have some of the most beautiful cars, but none of them are really considered rust free. The most beautiful cars that are trailer queens, you can eat off the bottom. Even some of those cars have rust in the inner frame rails, in the quarters, and places where those cars are prone to rust. Better questions in regards to rust would be, are there rust issues with the cars? Have any panels been replaced? Are the frame rails intact? Are the bottom pinch welds of the rockers and the doors and the quarters intact from the factory or have they been replaced? Has the car had any accidents where panels have been replaced and Bondo has been used? Those are really good questions to determine how original the body structure of the car is. To me, the most important thing is metal structure. Metal structure in the body panels, also the foundation and the undercarriage of your car. The frame rails, the floor pans, the body supports need to be solid intact to make sure you have a safe car to drive. One thing you really need to know about old cars is sometimes old cars act their age. They will leave you on the side of the road. They will definitely mark their territory in your driveway. Our guys work really hard to make these cars run and drive the way they should. But because they have 50-year-old parks, they're still going to require some maintenance. But at the end of the day, nothing has held its value like muscle cars and classic cars. It's one thing to have a beautiful looking car, but I, I try my hardest to make sure you have an awesome driving car as well.